Assalamualaikum. Hello, everyone. Um, now, I'd just like just like to make a simple video of uh, how to generate a literature matrix, as you can see here um, in this Excel folder. Now, um, a friend taught me how to do this, and I found it really helpful. Now. So here I'd like to, you know, record while I still remember the process to do it. Um, so yeah, so to, to generate an Excel uh, literature matrix as so, um, we, what uh, we use is uh, Mendeley and Atlas T. And so I'll quickly show you how to um, generate a literature matrix like this but like this by just dragging and dropping. Um, there are several settings to do, but um, I think once you get all that, it's simple enough for you to um, make a literature matrix uh, for uh, the number of articles that you like to synthesize. Okay, so let's start. So opening your Mendeley, what you have to do is, First, you go to File, Watch Folder. Now, you have to make sure you have two folders available. So I have two folders here, which is, um, this is my folder, okay? My Literature Review PhD and Watched. Okay, so I label these. So when you have, once you add or download an article in, sorry, once you download an article in the watch folder here, it will automatically go into two places, in here and in here. What's my understanding? So, um, so the settings that you have to um, complete are as so. So what you do is go to file a watch folder, and then you go to file organizer. And you determine the folder that you would like uh, your Mendeley to organize. So here I ticked um, the folder just now, my lit re review PhD from uh, my desktop. It's actually from my drive, my Google Drive. All right. And then I ticked here. All right, sort files and subfolders. Okay, so I, I picked this rename document files. I want Mendeley to rename my document files into my uh, my lit review PhD folder. So I placed in journal author year title and I click apply and then watch folders. Okay, so you you um, select the file the folder that you created on desktop which is on, for mine, it's desktop, and then you have watch. Or was it? Desktop, and yeah, watch. You can see that. See? Watch. Then apply. And OK. So what happens is uh, you'll have all these folders. What you'll see in your MyLit review, uh, your folder that you have organized just now is like so. I'm sorry, it's empty, oh my gosh. Let's do that again. I'm sorry, this is not in here, it's my in my other one, sorry. My drive and my lit review, yes. Okay, yeah, okay, so this is how it looks like where they have, uh, Mendeley has renamed everything with the um, author, date and the, the title of the article. Okay, so this makes it easy for you to have the name of the article in your literature matrix later. Okay, now then you go, you have all this imported. And so you select the articles that you like, for example, SO. Okay, and then you go to File, then you export, and then you click here. You have EndNote, and then you save. See, it'll be my collection. I'll put it here as testing for you guys. Testing, save. 
Okay, now if any time you feel confused or you can't remember the steps, you just uh, re uh, rewind uh, this video. Okay, and so you have that in. So then you open up um, Atlas T. Okay, and so here in Atlas T, you go straight to Import and Export Reference Manager. And you, t and you find the file, the exported file from Mendeley which is testing this now okay and then you take everything here everything here except language and um, addition language and addition okay we import case okay. Okay, so they've added except all of these. Okay, so now you have your documents. Now what you do now is you go to, you tick, um, okay, so for example, Hey, hey, you know. See now.